Hey everyone, it's Graphic back with another video, and today we're actually going to be talking about Brighter Shores, because there is a lot of hype surrounding this game that really not much details have been given out about. OSRS has been a staple in the really MMO community for so long now, with people playing thousands and thousands of hours, people have stacked themselves up against many others in something called the leaderboards. And this has been a big deal in old school RuneScape for so long. However, it is great to see that Brighter Shores is actually going to be using that in their game. So you can see here, if you go to brightershores.com slash roles, you're actually going to be able to see penalties and appeals. And about midway through that, you can see disqualification from leaderboards. This is a big one to point out because, again, we didn't really have confirmation that leaderboards were going to be a thing. But uh, thanks to a Reddit post pointing this out and many others pointing this out, people are starting to realize that, yes, leaderboards are going to be a thing in Brighter Shores. And again, this is a big deal because it's a huge feature in OSRS. People that want something competitive but love the kind of idea of OSRS, a new version where you can kind of explore and not really understand anything about the world when you first jump in, leaderboards are going to be a big help into really inspiring a competitive mindset to actually be able to play and kind of stay up to date with you know where they rank among so many other players in the leaderboards. Again, this has been a huge feature in OSRS for so long, and many people love it. And uh, you know why not add an additional feature like it? So great to see that. And then lastly, we have a confirmation on PvP leagues. Uh, PvP, when the game comes out, we already know is not going to be available to all of the players. However, it is definitely something they're working on very diligently. And uh, they say when the game fully releases out of early access, it will be available to us. That's great and everything. But there is one more detail, again, in the brightershores.com slash roles website, you can see the disqualification from PvP leagues. This is great because, again, more content, more features available to us, and that is going to be something that has been such a great feature in old school RuneScape for so long. It is great to see another great feature making its way to Brighter Shores. I would love to hear what your guys' thoughts are on PvP leagues as well as leaderboards. Are these important features that should be added to the game or are they features that they really shouldn't be focusing on as you want them to be focusing on getting trading and PvP in as quickly as possible and not on PvP leagues and leaderboards? Again, I think more features, the better, obviously, and a complete game is only going to be complete with all of these features put into one. So I'm excited to see where it goes. If you guys are as well, make sure to like the video, subscribe to the channel, and turn notifications on. I'll see you all in the next one.